Hey everyone, it's Amber from Down the Rabbit Hole, and it's that time of week again. Uh, it's another in my mailbox. I have a bunch of books to show you this week, so I'm going to go ahead and get started. Um, first up, I got two ARCs from HarperCollins. I requested them, and they were nice enough to send me them, and I'm really excited, so I'm just going to show you. First up is Incarnate by Jody Meadows, and as you can see, this cover is just as pretty in person. I couldn't believe when I got this in the mail. I was, oh, I, uh, my husband was like, what's wrong? I'm like, my mail is awesome. And then also from HarperCollins, Harper Teen, I got Everney by Bertie Ashton. And these actually came in at the exact same time. So that's why I was freaking out. Like even like double time. I was like, I got both of them, Brian. And he was like, um, nobody's dead, right? And I said, yes. So, that was good. But anyway, so there's Everney. And I'm very excited for this one as well. And then, um, I had lent out a book, Soul Thief, by Jan Oliver to Tiffany King. And she sent me her book in return, with, along with my other book back, Meant to Be. This is a self-published book, um... So thank you so much, Tiffany. I'll get to reading it. She also was nice enough to, oh, she gave me a little card, and she's nice enough to sign it. Right there. Yay! So I'll be reading that and reviewing that on the blog sometime. Meant to be. Okay. Then I got a couple books that I've already read, but I got finished copies of them, which was really awesome. First up is from Simon & Schuster, and it's this Dark Endeavor. Oh, wow, this is beautiful in person. And then look at the inside. Even more beautiful in person. Um, so, I was very excited to get a finished copy of this. Um, I gave it a three on the blog, but it really is a really good book. I just got a little squeamish at the end. But it's full of adventure, and it's a great boy and girl novel. And then I also, from HarperCollins, I got in Sweet Venom by Tara Lynn Childs. This I gave a five. I fell head over heel in love with this book. I loved all three characters and their voices, and I was so impressed that Tara Lynn Childs could redo an entire Greek mythology over again. She had already done one in Oh My God, so I don't know. I was just super impressed with this book. I loved it. And it's a trilogy. So this is the first one. So finished copy of that that I was really excited about. So again, thank you, HarperCollins. And then I also ordered one that I got from Amazon. And that is After Possession by Carrie Jones and Stephen E. Weedle. Weedle? Hopefully I said that right. Um, but I wanted to finish a copy of this one. And you can see it's all pretty. I enjoyed this book. Oh no. That makes me sad. Anyway, I enjoyed this book. And um, I love the alternating characters and the chapters. And how each author picked a, picked a character to write in a different chapter. So <clears throat> I really enjoyed this. Read it. And then I got another book from Amazon that I ordered accidentally. Like, it wasn't accidental, but I forgot that I ordered it, and so I bought it. So I'm going to be giving this away on the blog. I got Glow, again, by Amy Kathleen Ryan. So, Amy Kathleen Ryan, I am definitely supporting you. Um, anyway, so I'll be giving this one away on the blog eventually. But I got it in, again, from Amazon. And then I also bought two books this week. I went to the bookstore and bought them. My husband's limiting me on books now, so I had to be very good and pick the two that I wanted the most. So, I got Frost by Marina Bayer. Bayer? Um, you can see it's a thick little book. I've heard good things about it. It looks creepy. So it's kind of like perfectly for Halloween. And I'm always looking for fun, scary things to read on Halloween. Last year I read, um, Bad Girls Don't Die. 
and that was a fun Halloween read. So this year, Heartwood Frost. And then last but certainly not least, and I screamed when I saw it in my bookstore, and there was this lady in the aisle. She looked at me really weird, but I don't care. I bet she went and got this book after me. Daughter of Smoke and Bone by Lonnie Taylor. Oh my goodness. I've been dying for this book. I haven't read it. I was not lucky enough to get an ARC. Um, but I have read so many good reviews about this book. Everyone is raving about it. And I mean, look at this cover. Holy moly. So in love. So I had to pick it up. So I snatched it and hugged it to my bosom like so. And that was that. So that was my pile of books this week. I got some awesome things. See, thank you so much to um, Harper, Collins, and Simon and & Schuster, and Tiffany King for sending me some fun things. And that's about it this week. So I want to know, what did you get in your mailbox?